players who have you know sort of been crushing through the tournament most of the time. Yeah. Uh, and it is it is definitely in uh, it's definitely in Zamba's favor overall. But I believe the last two sets have gone to Apollo Kage when he double eliminated Zamba at uh, Battle of Z five months ago. Oh, okay. Dang, five months ago was the last time they played. I'm so surprised. Yeah, I mean, I feel like there's a tournament every damn weekend right now. Yeah, so, exactly. Yeah, so it, and these guys are almost <laughs> always there. They're always there. Yeah. Zama and Apollo Kage, two of the players that travel, I swear, everywhere. Yeah, yeah that's true. And, and it's rare for me to like be out in an event and like not see them. You yeah. know, like, oh, where are, where's Zamba? What's, what's he doing now? <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's right there. Yeah, right here, too, right here in NorCal at Guild House in downtown San Jose. And this is, this is it, man. You want to be able to move forward. Not only for the Watch the Throne spot, but just to like win the bracket, right? Absolutely. I mean, obviously these players want to watch the throne, but they also want to win. Like they, like I said before, Paul Kage is trying to win, trying to beat the person in front of him, and the person right now is the number one seed, Apollo Kage, which means, sorry, number one seed Zamba, which yes. means Apollo Kage has his work really good out for him. Yeah, yeah. I, I, th I think, uh, man, when I, whenever I do watch like Zamba play and play, uh, play against someone, oh jeez, what, what a way to get that kill! Just wow, lobbing the grenade way high in the air. Yeah, yeah. That, that, hey, that's the counterplay too, right? Like, hey, if you're just gonna stay high up in the air, like I have a projectile. And hey, look, Zamba has an answer too. Yep. I, I think that the one thing that uh, I noticed there was that Zamba tried to catch the grenade in the in midair and ended up getting an air dodge while catching the grenade, which caused the grenade to punish him. And that was what led to that sequence. So, yeah. oh, wow, wow. What, a, what a read. That was so was, gross. Was almost right. Okay, down throw. Are we going to be able to pick up this kill? What's the DI? Nice. Stays alive. 156. Of course, and, and you know what? This character. It's just so mad heavy. It is so hard to like really kill this character off the top, but hey, down the bottom though, Zamba's got it. That's one way to do it. That down air, such a beast of a move. Really meaty, lasts a super amount of super long amount of time, and it, it just is really easy to catch that uh, that cipher. Yeah, yeah, that, that's true. Especially if they have to like air dodge afterwards. You're like, oh, yummy, free <laughs> free down air. I'll free take stocks. it. Yep, exactly. It's free real estate. Uh, anyway, <laughs> moving yeah. along. This is a. a the coffee of explosions right now is, is, is I feel like the, the lead is just keeps staying in Apollo Kage's favor. Every single Whoa. opportunity, he, he racks up a little bit more percent, and these trades are benefiting him over and over again. Yeah, but hey, look, if you're trading so much to the point where you end up at kill percent, it could be bad right here. So I, I don't want to see Apollo Kage end up at death because, oh, no, it just happened. It just happened. He, he died because oh. of these trades. Yep, that's, that's something where, you know, you, you got to look at that in the replay and be like, why was I even there? Right, yeah. I mean, I, I understand. Yeah. You know, you try to double jump back air, see if you can get there before him. But look, Zamba, Zamba's quick with it. Absolutely. Now, just a big buildup of percent on Apollo Kage. This is something that is really difficult oh. from against Rob, but wow, what a combo. Uh, yeah, I'm actually surprised he went for the up tilt right there, too. I mean, it scoops. Yeah, and do be scooping. All right away from the ledge, back to the center of the stage. It is probably going to be hard. Wow, I can't believe he threw it down and it actually still hit Zamba right there. Looking so good, Apollo Kage actually has brought this back. Yeah, it gets a nether opening. How is Zamba going to get out of the corner? Does manage to air dodge through that Nikita, but has a wall of explosions still in front of his face. Yeah, thankfully Chiro does help alleviate a little bit of that pressure and also laser. Okay, nice answer to the up tilt, immediate down tilt right out of shield. Oh, the pressure is still real right here. You don't want to get picked up by that up tilt. Yeah, or that Nikita. Oh, oh the barely shield getting the so shield good. out of time. And he had an empty row of the gyro, but Apollo Kagi was not ready to punish. Oh my goodness, 172 right here for Zamba, actually. This is such dangerous territory to be in, especially against Apollo Kage, where anything could be lethal, even a down tilt? What? Oh, that was a Falco looking down tilt right there. It was. Ah. Yeah, that, that was lethal 100% ago. Zamba getting the getting uh, blown up by that C4. I mean, it's so hard to keep track of when there's a million projectiles flowing around. You got the laser, you got the gyro, you got the the double grenades. And as a character, I, I know I hate to uh, keep the trope going, but the character is pretty big, right? Yeah. So like, he big. Your hurt box uh, matters a lot, and you you don't really have that much extra play with your hurt box. You don't have that much like hurt box shifting, except maybe hey like down tilt or crouch. But you're like, if you're doing that, then you're stationary. And you're not really getting any mileage, right? You're not doing nothing. Yeah, it's 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 difficult to really choose because there's so much. 
There's so many options that you have at any given point as Rob, but a lot of them are just going to run into these projectiles because Apollo Kai is constantly mixing up what throws he's doing with the grenades, where he's dropping them, how he's covering the platform with them. And I'm, I'm really liking, you know, the dribbles he was doing with them to cover yes. the high aerial space, which is normally something that, you know, Rob's prefer. They love being high in the air. They love you being able to use that fastball neutral air to cover a lot of your, your options in forward air from the skies. Already Apollo Kage starting this game off hot yeah. and a double explosion. Yeah. Triple. Then, look, Rob is super good at boxing, but Apollo Kage, very, very well known for like boxing with Snake, right? So, hey, you, you, you get into my zone, we'll box, we'll play. Okay, looking for something crazy there. I'm not sure what it was, but he doesn't find it. All he finds is a, a nice little axe kicking. Yeah, Zamba, once again, behind. Yeah, Zom I can see Zomba frustrated right there, but nice catch. Thanks, the trades. Thanks, thank you, trades. Yeah. I will take it any day. Definitely a GameStop trade right there. Okay. On to this. Wow, this, this this is actually so frustrating too, right? Like you you have like the lead and now like Snake comes back from the angel platform and starts setting up and you're like, wow, okay, I'm at, I'm here right here at the corner and now I can't move anywhere. Like what did I what have I done to myself? Right now, Zamba, he's, he's looking so hard for an opening, but Apollo Kage is giving him almost nothing. Good trade there that time for Apollo Kage. Right, yeah. And it does it does help that, like, Snake, at least the rest of the aerials can, like, really be a little bit quicker. Like, oh, oh my god. He's living. He's yeah. living. He went through the whole thing with the with the Cypher and its uh, armor, I guess. Yes, yes. I was just so surprised that, like, Zamba actually opted to go all the way. Once again, there it is, another time. But, hey, the empty land up tilt, catching Zamba off guard again. Yeah, something that worked out super well. I'm surprised that that back air didn't activate the grenade, but still just getting a ton of percent right now on Zamba. Every, every bit of extra credit is so huge for Snake, a character that thrives on their opponent just trading with them over and over again. And RP at 90, what's happening? Yeah, another stop the yard, another dare for Paulo Kage. Looking so good, this ledge trap uh, manages to find the way out. Zamba actually has to find the stock soon, otherwise he's dead. And dead indeed. Oh, I get cleaning that up with a two stock. That final, that final stock was just everything going right for AK over yes. and over again. So many explosions converted off of so many places. He just mounted that percent and mounted the pressure. And I think what's funny too in these scenarios is that usually whenever Snake does like set up a bunch of grenades, you use laser to really kind of clear the field. Uh, but there are plenty of instances where laser was just not in a good position for Zamba, right? He did a laser, actually caught Apollo Kage's shield with a grenade and ended up getting comboed himself. Like they, the positioning right here from Apollo Kage has been spectacular. <laughs> Yeah, that, I, that eye roll from Zamba, kind of funny. I feel like it, it might be, it, I was hoping for him it would be the start of something big, but. Oh, I, I believe it. I love when like Zamba is just ready to play. Yeah. Okay, nice chase. Very good positioning actually on Zamba's end this time around. I feel like these, these aggressive aerials out of the corner have been working super well for AK, so he's trying to keep them going. But, you know, Zamba definitely punishing a lot of them over and over again. Finally losing that advantage state as AK once again brings it back to center stage. Right, yeah. Okay, another laser, but the M Wow! Wow, the, the neutral air dodge to get back onto the ground and up tilt. Like, these up tilts have been working so well for Apollo Kage. That's that sort of late ultimate meta we were, we were talking about where it's just like the jump air dodge is such oh a gosh. great way to get in. But right now, he's hunting so far. Just a foreigner unable to find the up air. And AK lives to see another day wow. and get even more percent yeah. whiffed. I see exactly what Zamba was trying to go for right there. Actually dashed straight past Apollo Kage to get back to the center of the stage. Apollo Kage recognized and picked up a down tilt. This is looking so good for your boy, man. Yeah, I mean, one of, one of the things I really liked about what I saw there was Zamba using the fresh laser to break through the cypher. Yes. It does enough to break it, which is very rare for a projectile like that. And yeah. yeah, just gonna try to use Nikita to get a little bit of percent. Unfortunately for Apollo Kage, got stuck in a little bit of a pineapple there. Yeah, that's PS2, but you still can get pineapples. What, what, whatever happened to our game, man? <laughs> where, where, where is Dreamland? I don't know. Not here, though. And no. there. Very dangerous position for, for Zamba. We've seen how easily AK can convert off of things, or even just find a crazy read for an up tilt, which Zamba is I, almost certainly dying to at this point. Yeah. Definitely dying now. Ooh. Oh, I was expecting the, the empty land. There are so many like situations that Zamba is actually 
doing a really good job answering all of Paul Kage's movement and really tracking extremely well. And you have to track like well against this character, right? Yeah. You have to be in the zone to perfectly like place yourself in between all those B reverses. Or potential ones too. Yeah, and first big real lead for Zamba here as 24% isn't much to speak of, but it's definitely better than being behind. Yeah, that up air is just so good. Who does rising up air? Like double jump rising up air? Like as Snake? Like He's crazy. Doing that. A AK, AK is crazy. Yeah, true, true. Very. Really nice parry, but actually gets punished on hit, and now Zamba in a really great position, but another grenade bails out AK. Yeah. Such a godsend. Yeah, and that I feel like that was preemptive, too. He noticed he caught the grenade, and he knew, okay, I could use just the invincibility to really set up a good situation for myself. Holokage looking good, but I don't know. Oh, into the up no, air, no. and oh, just as you talked about how good he was with the grenades and using those and using those things advantage even when they're in his hand. Uh, it had to happen. It like had that. to happen. A little bit of commentator curse in first game. What am I doing? <laughs> of Zamba's set. I mean, two one now. Two one. AK certainly has an opportunity to take this and move on into winners finals, but. Zamba, Zamba's turning it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. And it's always uh, fun to watch Zamba whenever he does like sit down and walk in, right? Because the gameplay just becomes like that much better. Uh, just very aware of like everything that Apollo Kage wants to do. It's like, okay, you can be aware of it, but sometimes like Apollo Kage just sets himself perfect, sets himself up perfectly to the point where like it does not matter. Like if yeah. you know what's gonna happen, like you know you're gonna die, and it's uh, you go, you gonna die for real. Oh, but right now, oh. Apollo Kage, the one looking to be. Dying. Yeah, 27% only on uh, Zamba's end to 84 is always a good thing when you're playing against Snake. <laughs> yeah, we, we've harped on it a lot, but I feel like it, it is it is very difficult to overstate how good it is to be ahead versus Snake. It's just the entire pace of the match absolutely shifts, and we're already seeing it now Ooh. where Zamba is just forcing AK into these positions. He does not find comfortable and is doing so well at getting out of well, what a what a grenade savior once again. Yeah, yeah. And th this is all like preemptive too, right? Ooh. <laughs> that situation, as soon as he saw the Nair, he knew exactly what was going to happen. The up throw, not able to do anything, but actually finds in that forward air right there. Yeah, one way of getting it done. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Yeah, that move just does not work a lot of but times. Even on like Rob, this character, like, <laughs> what? If any character is going to be hit with the whole thing, it's Rob. Yeah, yeah. And it's, fun it's funny to talk about like traits pretty often with these two characters because Rob is a character who can be pretty durable, but so is Snake, right? So like now you're really just like looking at like these percents. Okay, like really who won here? <laughs> and yeah. most of the time it feels like Apollo Kage be winning. I, I think the, the trades are almost always benefiting AK, especially with the grenades, because it just feels like he's so much more Ooh. comfortable out of the grenade hit stun. Uh, it, he just always knows where's he's, where he's going to be, what's, what's going to be happening, and can make that just a huge advantage for himself. Right. He's, racking up even more percent on this potential final stock already knowing oh try to go for something spicy there yeah actually he was in he was definitely in the kitchen cooking something real spicy and actually i think it's probably still happening right now paul kage moving so well definitely grooving around but zamba is not a person to be deterred he will absolutely give give his all at every point in the game and at certain points, you, you might just find yourself in a massive vortex of death as this robot comes for you, but right now it just looks like Apollo Kage is going to be the one to take it. Zama's got to find the kill right now. He's so high. Yeah. How is he so high up there? I like the attempt at a Nair right there from uh, Zamba too. Okay, picks up with the up tilt, but not able to find anything afterwards. Stays away from that C4. That was so close to that hitting. Oh, no. Do you think Zamba knew it was there? Uh, I don't know, actually. I, I wouldn't be able to tell you considering like how close he was to it. Oh, no. That could have killed if it connected. A wow. smash out of shield. Zamba. Zamba is one hit away on death's door. Apollo Kage is knocking. The backer out of shield's not going to connect. Zamba has one more chance. I want to see it happen, man. I want to see this game number this five. Game. Yeah. I don't know. All AK needs is a laundry <laughs> list of things. Yeah. He's hey. got Nair. He's got up air. Oh, he's got no a way. Not dribbled again. off the ground once again. Zamba found himself, he found himself hanging out way up, way up in the skies. Blue a little too close to the sun and is that a one piece card? <laughs> that is that is the monkey D Luffy Alter. Oh, okay. The that he's been posting about on Twitter. He definitely secured it and he points to it. Did he saying, get it here? This is the reason for my victory. Oh, it's it, it's 
<laughs> other, other camera, other camera. <laughs> All right, I think he's talking to someone. Oh, he's, he's, he's pointing. Oh, okay. I think he was showing it to oh, one staff. Yeah, we actually have a cameraman on site, so. 